Photography Ideas for Your Etsy Store. Five Tips from Professional Photographers. The photos that you take of your products, after all, are going to be what captures the attention of your target audience, no matter whether they're new customers or customers who've bought from your Etsy shop in the past. A lot of new Etsy sellers wonder how to take great photos for their Etsy shop. After all, no one is born a professional photographer, and while you could always hire a professional photographer to take photos for you, that might not work with your budget. Here are five of the best tips from professional photographers to help you get started. 1. Use natural light. Using natural light is one of the best ways to accurately capture the colors and details of your Etsy products. When photographing, place your product close to a window on a day with ample sunlight. Position your camera in a way that allows the light to illuminate your product evenly. Remember, natural lighting and clear windows can create harsh shadows, so take this into consideration when setting up your camera. 2. Use a tripod. Although it's possible to take photos without a tripod, having one can significantly improve the quality of your product photos. Even if you believe you have a steady hand, you may notice slight movements, especially when trying to capture small important details in close-up shots. If you don't have a tripod, it's definitely worth the investment. You'll never have to worry about accidentally taking blurry photos again. 3. Take plenty of close-up shots. If your phone has a macro mode, it's great for taking close-up pictures. Once you figure out how to use it well, you can take really detailed photos of your products. These close-up shots can show off special details and give your customers a clearer idea of what you're selling. Don't rush when you're taking these photos. The time that macro photography takes will be well worth it. 4. Create a nice backdrop. Many customers today prefer product photos taken in front of a simple or neutral background without any distractions. Although this might seem a bit dull, it's important to display your product from different viewpoints against a plain backdrop. Your product should be the main focus of the photo after all. While you can still include lifestyle shots, remember to take a few pictures without any distractions. Make sure to use pleasant colors or colors that match the aesthetic of your product for your backdrop. Remember though, these colors should complement your product, not overshadow it. 5. Avoid using stock photos. This is a common issue on Etsy. Many third-party platforms offer default stock photos for mock-ups, which can be helpful for new handmade business owners who are trying to get their products listed quickly. However, these stock photos are often generic and overused. If you spend time browsing Etsy, you'll notice many sellers using the same models and backgrounds for their listing photos. This not only makes it hard for your shop to stand out from the competition, but also may turn off customers. For example, if they come across identical mock-ups in multiple shops, they might prefer listings with unique photography instead of ones that look exactly the same as others. This is why putting in the extra effort to take high-quality original photos is so important. As you can see, there's a lot of thought that needs to go into taking high-quality photos for your Etsy shop. These tips from professional photographers should help you get started. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.